Well, if you think learning computer technology and say a foreign language is advanced, how about this? A group of ninth graders get an up close lesson in heart surgery. This is a stitch. This is where we sew things up with. The lesson of the day, repairing the mitral heart valve on a 60-year-old woman. Cleveland Clinic heart surgeon Dr. Mark Gilanoff controls the surgical robotic arm to make the repairs, while 70 students at John Hayes School of Science and Medicine watch his every move. This blue stitch is actually made out of a type of plastic, and it'll stay forever. These students all have an interest in the medical field and applied into the School of Science and Medicine. So I want to be a trauma surgeon in this science and medicine, and it got a lot of stuff to do with science, and I like science, so I thought it would better my chances. It challenges you to do better and stay at what, what you really want to do, and it takes you to a higher level of what you really want to do. Actually witnessing heart surgery is an extension of what these high schoolers are learning in the classroom. When we did the unit on the heart, I researched the Da Vinci surgical system. I found out information about it, but I found out even more from today. I like to actually see the person who actually uses hands to fix people up and make them healthier. A special partnership between the clinic and the video company, One Community, helps bring this video signal into John Hay High School. Students today are growing up in a technology age, and this is an opportunity for us to bring those real-world experiences directly into the classroom. The goal is that these students will become skilled medical professionals who want to give back to the Cleveland community. I guess we are going to do it, but I'm going to the Cleveland Clinic to work. <laughs> Good for her. She's already got that goal set. That's a great program. Yes, isn't that terrific? Yeah. I'm sorry. I had to take care of some business there. <laughs> okay.